We looking at it happening and shit. I'm like watching it about to happen. I see a car turn. He turn with he turning like through the little intersection and bah, smack him. Yo, what's poppin'? It's Phoenix Flexin'. It's a little story about the first time I did acid in high school. Back in high school, you know what I mean? There was like rumor like, oh yeah, somebody had acid. Like, you know what I'm saying? One of like the hippie kids. We had had mushrooms from him some other time. That's a different story for another day. I remember I took mine right before lunch. You know what I mean? I really wouldn't even go to class like that anyway. And I remember I just went to my class. It was like art class or something. So it was cool. You know what I mean? I was like, I wasn't really tripping off it like that. I'm like, man, I don't feel nothing. Like, this is whack. You know what I mean? So I took another little piece while I'm in class. I started feeling kind of jittery, like high energy. You know what I mean? I'm like, oh, maybe, maybe I'm feeling a little something. You know what I mean? I get up. I walk around, I'm like, all right, I'm gonna go for a walk. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go see if like, if anything else going on, I'm gonna tap in with the homie, see what they got going on. I go out there, first thing I see, my boom, <laughs> the homie laid out on, the, on, a, on a lunch table. He laid out flat, everybody around him, I go over there, see what's going on, and he tripping, you know what I'm saying? He's saying all type of crazy shit, you know what I mean? Then he talking about, uh, like he, he was like uh, sweating, and he feel like the sweat, like he feel like it's part of his skin, you know what I mean? So he was tripping on like, some whole other shit, you know what I mean? So I'm like, in my head, I'm thinking like, damn, well, I must have got like hella solid tolerance, you know what I mean? Cause I ain't feeling nothing. I remember I go back to class, I sit down, I'm chopping it up. I, I started feeling kind of nauseous, you know what I mean? Like I was gonna throw up. So I told the teacher like, hey, like I'm finna get up and like, you know what I mean? I, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go real quick, you know what I mean? I didn't even tell him how to go to the bathroom. I said I had to go. I stood up, then I got like stupid tunnel vision, like crazy, like from where I was to like where the like the front of the classroom was, looked like a like a mission. And I felt big as hell. I remember feeling big like a, I felt like my head was at the top of the ceiling. Definitely getting like the little visual thing. I get up and I'm walking out. I, and I'm like, the, the homie say something, he like, you look pale. He like, he like, Phoenix, you look pale, bro, you good? So I look over, I'm about to say something. And like the whole class like looked like like fucking paper Mario. Like everybody like uh like two-dimensional, like that shit was like flat. I, I was trying to, you know what I'm saying, recollect it, gather myself. I go outside and I see the homie trip and I go over there again. him. He like, come on, we gone. I remember we did school. We just hopped over the fence, hopped on the bus, got up out of there. This where it, it getting even crazier. We hop off the bus and we with the other homie, right? And he like kind of big. He got like this beanie on and like a red sweater. I'm tripping so hard, he looked like Cartman from South Park, you know what I'm saying? And I look at my boy, and he looking at me like hella strange, you know what I'm saying? Like, like he about to crack up, you know, like the look you make when you about to crack up. We, it's like we had an exchange of words without, ex without exchanging words, like straight up on some mental frequency shit or something, I don't even know. We like said to each other that he looked like Cartman and like started cracking up from the joke like that. I swear that shit was crazy as hell. We walking up to the park, the whole like, the street, the cars and everything, feel like it's just going like, like a wave, you know what I mean? Like, it, it felt like my whole, like my body rocking, like a wave or something. And at this point, I guess everybody who had like came from school had got some, you know what I mean? So we met up at the park and then everybody was tripping. I had to take a little step away, you know what I'm saying? Everybody talking all crazy, doing some wild shit, you know what I mean? I go walk around the park. It's like a bunch of different like flowers and shit around there, you know what I mean? I'm stopping and looking at shit like, like colors has changed, I swear to God, bro. So it was like, it made everything look like beautiful, like hella colorful and shit. Like everything was looking crazy and I had like a million thoughts per second. I was like, I felt like I was cracking a cola life or something. I swear to God, it was crazy, you know what I mean? But uh, I get back. I think we went to go get some beer. We went to go get some beer. The semester curricular beverages, still reserved. You know, that, that shit nasty. And we had the little penny board, so we was like skating to the spot. The, the homie kind of going fast, like he on his own shit, you know what I mean? He on his own trip. He probably like on some other shit, you know what I mean? So he dipping, boom, he going down the street hella fast. Right at the corner, we looking at it happening and shit. And you, I, I see like a, I'm like watching it about to happen. I see a car turn. He turned with, he turned like through the little intersection and bah, smack him. He got rolled over on the car and everything. My boy popped up with the 40, you know what I'm saying? Untouched, unscathed, you know what I mean? Just brushed it off like a real one, you know what I mean? It was wild, I ain't gonna lie, it was a wild day. And the next day, Boom, we did it all over again. Can't make it up. And after that, I don't, I don't think I ever did acid again, though. I wasn't the primary example of what a high schooler should be like, you know what I mean? I wouldn't want my kids to be like me, you know what I'm saying? But I feel blessed to have went through what I went through because now, uh, man, made me who I am today, you know what I mean? And also, like, with my kids and shit, I'd be on it. They could try something they want, but I, you know what I mean? It pops no little something. <laughs> Tales from the...